Ah. Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. My name is Kelly and welcome to Kayla Creates. Um, so today I am doing this burgundy type maroony look right here. Um, I am really excited that it's starting to feel like fall even though it's still like 95 degrees here in North Carolina. Um, but it is starting to cool off. It's starting to get into those cozy sweater vibes. Um, obviously I'm not feeling them. I'm wearing a tank top right now, but I wanted to embrace it with my makeup. So um, I just wanted to go a little bit more dark, a little bit more vampy. But if you guys want to see how I got this look, just follow along. Okay, so even though I already have my eyebrows on, I'm going to be doing them anyway. So I have my Milani soft brown stay put brow color um, in the shade soft brown um, and then my ABH brush I'm just gonna go ahead and fill these babies in even more all right and then I'm gonna be cutting my brows with my Tarte Shape Tape this is in the shade light All right, and then I'm moving on to primer, so I'm going to prime my eyes with my Morphe Eyelid Primer. All right, and then the palette that I'm gonna be using today is my Winky Lux Kitten Palette. Um, I got this way back with Boxy Charm. Um, but I'm going to be starting off with this cream shade right here. I feel like I'm throwing it back to like the first few months I was doing YouTube. Uh, but this is the shade Duchess. I'm just setting that primer. Okay, next I'm going to be going in with my It Cosmetics brush. This is the kind of like dual ended one. Um, but I'm going to start by um, starting by just putting a little bit of color in my crease. So this one right up here, it's called Strut. Okay, and then next I'm going to be going in with a little bit of the maroon shade that's right down here. That is called Cheshire? 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 I'm the worst at pronouncing these. I'm going to be going in with this dark brown shade that's down here. That is the shade Boots. And I'm just adding this to the outer corner and blending it into my crease. All right, and then I'm gonna be going in with just my finger and this shade down here. This is Romeo. It's all over my face, so I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna leave it. I'll clean it all up in a second. Um, next, I'm going to be going in with just a little bit of this shade right here. It's called Holographic, and I'm just going to dot this right in the center of my lid just to give myself a little dimension. All right, now I really need to clean up under my eyes. So as I was cleaning up under my eyes, I realized I never turned my microphone on. I'm the worst YouTuber ever. I mean it. I'm the worst. I guess I'm just gonna move on. Um, I'm going to be putting on some eyeliner. So this is the CoverGirl Liquid Liner. It's just the black one. And you already know I'm gonna be winging it out. Now I'm going to prime my face using my CoverGirl True Blend Face Business. Um, this is the moisturizing one. And then for foundation today, I am pretty tan actually for myself, so I'm gonna be mixing two foundations. I'm gonna be mis mixing my CoverGirl True Blend and my ColourPop No Filter. Um, I'm going to leave the shade names down below. And 
And then for concealer, I'm gonna be using my ColourPop No Filter Concealer. This is in the shade Light 14. To set my face today, I'm gonna be using my Becca Hydramus Set and Refresh Powder and a big fluffy Aesthetica brush. And then to contour, I'm gonna be using my Tarte uh, Park Ave Princess palette is Princess Cut, this one right here. And this is a Crown Pro brush. Okay, and then before I forget, I'm gonna finish off under my eyes, and I'm gonna be using that same palette, and I'm gonna go in with the burgundy again, the Cheshire. And then just a little bit about of that Boots shade on the outer corner. And then I'm going to highlight my inner corner with that um, holographic shade again even though this holographic shade is not holographic. I'm also gonna highlight my brow bone with that as well. And then for blush, I'm gonna be going in with my Pretty Vulgar Make Them Blush Hush Blush. And then I'm going in with my, my highlighter. This is Mary Luminizer by The Balm. It is the bomb. And then to set my face, I'm using this Wet n Wild Photo Focus Natural Finish Setting Spray. I have not used this yet, so let's see. I'm scared. Oh man. <coughs> I'm swimming in it. I'm just going to put a little bit more mascara on just because this is from earlier today. Um, this is the Tarte Big Ego Mascara. All right, so these are the Lily Lashes Limited Edition Faux Minx Lashes. They are really big, really fluffy. Um, I feel like I wanna fly away on them. Um, <laughs> but I think they fit pretty well with this look, except I am awful at putting on lashes, so maybe I shouldn't try and fly away. So the lipstick that I'm going to be using is the Hard Candy Velvet Mousse uh, Dahlia. Um, this color is a bit more red than I was looking for. So I'm going to be mixing it with some NYX Liquid Suede in Brooklyn Thorn. I think that is it for my face. Um, so I'm going to go brush my hair out a little bit and I will be right back. And that is the final look. Well, thank you guys so much for coming out to my video today. I really, really appreciate you watching me just playing with my makeup. Um, I wanted to do something a little bit, I guess, more wearable, because I've been doing a lot more artsy crazy looks lately, um, so I guess this is more of a going out look. Um, if you guys want to see more of what I do every day type of thing, um, let me know. Um, but yeah, thank you guys so much for coming today. Thank you guys for watching me. Leave me a big thumbs up if you like this. Subscribe if you want to see more. And I hope you have a wonderful night wherever you are. Bye.